Um, thank you very much, our, the chair for the celebrations. Mukamawangi, Katikiro of Uganda. The chair of the University Council. My OB from Saga College Mwiri, the Vice Chancellor of the University, Professor Banabas Nawangwa. Our Soria, my colleagues, the ministers from Mengo, allow me to stand on the protocol that has been well cited here in the interest of time. I'm not the head of family, but I'm a member of the family. I'll use two minutes to introduce the head of the family, who will use eight minutes to make remarks on behalf of the family of OHT the red mantles and severe one. As a family, we are not only related, but we are humbled by this gesture of the university hosting this premier and inaugural lecture for my grandfather, for our father, and for our great grandfather. We are very humbled and very grateful. I was at this university between 1989 and 1992 pursuing Bachelor of Statistics in University Hall. Unfortunately, I was not in Silver Hall. And uh, uh, I'm a proud alumni, I'm a head of the like Katikiro, but we were there in different years. The head of the family is a trained social worker. She's been a career leader in this country, having served as a minister in three different governments of Uganda. She was a member of the National Recent Council, a member of the National Constituent Assembly, a member of parliament for Chiboga, for over a decade. She is the eldest of the only surviving three children today out of the 26. I was having a debate with her last night. Were you 27 or were you 26? I said we are 26. And she is 93 and we thank God um, that her faculties are still all alert. She is the chairperson of Mantles and Sivirwa Trust, and she has been able escorted by the only surviving Tata we have. Uh, she is the sister to my father, late father, but we have one surviving father who was the second last born at the date of assassination. He was six years old. He's now 83 years. Um, I wish to introduce to you Tata John Sendagir and Sivirwa. Um, our singer, Mrs. Rwada Robin, I couldn't make it. She's a bit unwell, and she's also of advanced age. So those are the three children that still survive to date, and we are very, very proud of them, and we treasure them a lot. Um, she's also accompanied by we, the grandchildren, and I request the grandchildren to stand up. Um, those are the grandchildren of the late grandchildren and Sibira. Some of them went through the school. Over 51 grandchildren and great-grandchildren went through this university. And two children out of the 27 went through this university. The late Dr. Sam Sibira and the late Dr. Rosemary Nakasin Sibira Chigonya. I also wish to introduce to you the great-grandchildren uh, that have uh, come with us, the great-grandchildren, stay standing, and the two of them work here. We have Jingo, is Jingo around? He works with the university here, and also um, Brian Nsubuga. They work with you, Vice-Chancellor. Brian, put up your hand, you may get a promotion. Yeah? Uh, the OB is trying to anger you. 
So, friends, welcome with me, Honarebo, Roda, Nareje, Nachibuka, Nsibirwa, Karema. She will speak from her seat, given her youth, and she has a written speech, and we shall keep time. Thank you very much.